Hey there everyone, how ni how, this is Chiquito and today, finally, I'm gonna shoot a day in the live series for the first time, I'm super excited to show you this so I'm going to Wanyong's house right now Woman oh Kashoba This handsome guy waking up is Wang Yong, a Chinese language student who lives in a two-bedroom apartment in Shanghai's most beloved neighborhood, the former French concession. It is common for international students to live outside of campus, especially in central Shanghai, where they can enjoy of all the perks of the big city life. Students don't usually live in such fancy apartments as Wang Yong's, but he said he got lucky with his landlord. Oh man, I wish I had the same luck. <laughs> okay, I gotta admit he's quite funny, but not only that. As you may have noticed, Wang Yong speaks only in Chinese. He says that learning Chinese is his current goal, and at the age of 37, if you wanna get fluent in a new language, you gotta be completely immersed in the environment, so he prefers speaking in Chinese if possible. He prefers cooking in the mornings himself, especially since he loves eating traditional Turkish breakfast, just like today. And even though Shanghai has many Turkish shops, Wang Yong's cooking is on another class. Trust me, we share some of that delicious food he cooked today. Eating out is very common in Shanghai among students, especially for breakfast. So I was very thankful to Wang Yong for sharing his food with me and letting me enjoy the process of eating at home, which I seldomly do myself. <laughs> to awaken himself for the intense learning process that Chinese language requires, Wang Yong likes to grab some coffee on the way to school. And unlike the vast majority of people in Shanghai, he commutes by bus. I can already tell this man is quite special. While commuting, Wang Yong checks on his TikTok account as he is trying to grow his channel. Don't worry girls, I'm leaving a link in the description below so you can start following him. Apart from that, he also checks other creators on the app to get inspired by them and learn something useful. The best part of riding the bus in Shanghai is that they have a designated lane on the roads and nobody else can ride on it, so regardless of the time of the day, there is no traffic. <laughs> when Yong is late for school today because of me. <laughs> Apparently, it's the first time it happens this semester, but that's all right. Today they have a more relaxed day. You will see what I'm talking about. When Yong studies Chinese in a language program consisting of five levels. Currently, he's in the last level as he's been studying the language for around three years. As you can see, he's pretty well known by the people around, not only for the time he's been studying, but by the fact that he can communicate in Chinese with them. And also, of course, he's outgoing and I gotta say, charming personality. <laughs> Luckily for him, today is movie time. Usually, every couple of weeks on Fridays, the school organizes special activities, including outings, cultural events, or, as is the case today, movie time. I know what you're thinking. Chiquito, I wanted to see what they learn. Haha, <laughs> as if I would reveal the secrets of Donghua University's successful Chinese language program. You wish. 
While Wang Yong was busy asking funny questions to the teacher, I decided to talk to some of the other students. In English? Yeah, it's fine. Uh, no, in Chinese. In Chinese. <laughs> they don't want to talk to me in English, so I'm going to have to ask them in Chinese. Hi, I'm Li Zhixuan. Wang Yong is your friend? Yes, Wang Yong is my good friend. How are you learning? 啊，他学习很认真，很认真是吧？我听说。Uh, <laughs> Everybody seems to agree that Wang Yong studies very hard. I'll tell you in a while why is that. But first, let's listen it from the teacher. 我第一次见王勇是两年以前，他那个时候汉语说的真不咋地。两年以后，他的汉语有了明显的提高。我很高兴。谢谢谢谢老师，谢谢。骄傲这样的一个认真的、负责的，然后又乐观向上的。<laugh
凶的现在我饿死，我们去一个日本餐厅，非常好吃的。On weekdays, Wen Yong would usually go out for dinner, but like most students on a Friday night, it would be a sin not to do so. This super momo yakitori's lamb is very tasty and beautiful. It's him. Look at him. I think I know why you like this place now, Wen Yong. Jokes aside, you probably have noticed by now that Wen Yong likes maintaining a friendly relationship with the people he encounters frequently in his life, and this place's owner is no exception. 我喝有喜欢威士忌，我是传统的人，我喜欢喝威士忌，也有喜欢我喜欢那个白喝白酒，白酒非常好喝的，是的，我非常喜欢。白酒 is a traditional Chinese alcoholic drink made of rice or wet, and is known for its high amount of alcohol, up to 60%. That's too much for someone like me. But I can see this tall gentleman has no problem handling such drinks. Actually, Wang Yong is now inviting me to eat, so I must thank him. So thank you, Wang Yong. Very delicious. But like the old saying says, all good things come to an end, and it was time for me to go home. Thank you, Wang Yong. Thank you for letting me have a good day with you. If you're happy, I'm happy. If you're sad, I'm sad. I'm happy. I'm going home. I really feel that I'm very lucky to have you here with me. 整个这一天特别好玩，特别丰富。他是个非常好玩的人，所以下次见，我走了。谢谢这样兄弟，再见了，拜拜，拜拜。<笑>再见。Thanks everyone for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more content like this, please don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and uh, share the video with your friends. And please let me know uh, in the future what kind of video would you like me to shoot regarding a day in the life series. That's it for me today. See you next time. Ta-way.